What's up world, it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to shoot nearly 4K video with your Nexus 5. Now you have to be running Android 5.0 to take advantage of this, but I've got an easy to follow guide on installing the Lollipop preview build if you want to give it a try. Just head to the full tutorial at the link in the description below this video and you'll find everything you need to get this going today. So one of the biggest under the hood changes in Android 5.0 is a new robust camera API. This allows developers to hook into the actual camera sensor like never before. And as a result of that, picture quality can be greatly improved. Developer PKMX has been pushing this new API to its limits with his new app L Camera. It's available on the developer's GitHub page, and I've got a link to that over the full tutorial as well. Since the app isn't on Google Play yet, you'll need to enable unknown sources in your phone's settings before you can install it. But that's easy enough. From Settings, just head to Security, then tick the box next to Unknown Sources, and press OK. With that done, go ahead and grab the installer file for L Camera, then tap the Download Complete notification. From here, press Install, and then when that's finished, tap Open. This is a very robust camera app with lots of powerful options, so let me head somewhere with a little more headroom to give you a demo. Out of the box, you can just point and shoot like a regular camera app, but if you want to see some of the more advanced features, tap this three-dot menu button. Under Focus here, you can actually set the focus mode to manual. Then you can use this slider to set the focus point further away or closer up. Back in the main settings menu again, there's some awesome exposure options. Just turn auto mode off, then you can adjust the exposure timing in ISO setting. These two options work in conjunction with one another, so tweak one, then fine tune the other. There's one last still camera setting to see before we check out the video recording. Burst mode lets you take quick shots in rapid succession. And you can even set up focus and exposure stacking if you're okay with doing a little editing in post. And speaking of post-processing, all images taken with the L Camera app will be stored as both a processed JPEG and a raw DNG file. So if you have software capable of handling raw images, you can get much better picture quality with a little processing after the fact. But now let's go ahead and check out the video recording. Just tap the camera icon to switch modes, then you can still adjust focus and exposure manually if you want to. But let me just take a quick video so I can show you the killer feature here. So I just recorded like normal, but it was somehow taking almost 4K resolution. The Nexus 5's camera sensor is supposedly limited to 1080p video recording, but you can see that this is not actually true. Just look at the details for any video you take with the L camera app. Not 1920 by 1080 but 3264 by 2448 And the frame rate still holds strong at 30 FPS. So this new Android Camera API is an absolute miracle worker. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.